YouTube Niner Empire, the 49ers drafted uh, Ty Davis Price out of LSU running back in the, uh, the third round of the 2022 NFL draft at pick 93. Um, this pick kind of confused me in a way. I really didn't think the 49ers would take a running back this early. Um, they did it last year with Trey Sermon, and I really think that speaks volumes with them taking another running back. Um, when it comes to how they feel about Trey Sermon and Elijah Mitchell. Um, I think that the 49ers haven't been able to look for a three-down back since Raheem Mostert. And obviously with Raheem Mostert in Miami, didn't play last season. Um, the 49ers struggled, you know, with having a three-down running back. Hence to why they had to play Debo Samuel. Um, you know, at running back. Uh, so I definitely think that taking a, a running back this high and, and taking Ty Davis Price, um, I do think that that's going to, I think the 49ers are thinking, okay, look, you know, if we can get a three down running back, we're not going to have to play Debo Samuel at running back, even though I do think Debo at running back is very, very, you know, luxurious and scary. Um, but either way, you know, the 49ers shouldn't have to play Debo at running back. If they had a good running back that, you know, like Raheem Mostert that they could stick with on three downs, you know, I think that Debo probably would have never played running back in the first place. But like I said, I think taking Ty Davis Price this early in the draft speaks volumes on how they feel about Trey Sermon and Elijah Mitchell. Um, but look, I mean, with Ty Davis Price... You know, he gives the 49ers a bulky back at six foot, 211 pounds. He also adds an element of speed. He ran a 4.48 40-yard dash. Um, he also ran track in high school. Um, so I think, you know, he moves like a smaller back on the field, uh, but he's a phenomenal running back. You know, um, his vision's very good. He runs behind his blockers. Um, he has, you know, bursts of speed. Um I like the pick for the most part. I just think it's a little bit surprising. I think, like I said, it speaks volumes on how they feel about uh, the current running backs on the roster. Um, but, I mean, it is what it is. I think that, you know, he could potentially be a, our, our starting running back. He could potentially be a three-down running back. And um, I think with that, um, it's good for the 49ers. And like I said, it, you know, it takes, it takes some – some, you know, pressure off of Debo having to play running back. You know, there were reports about him not wanting to play running back. I don't really think those are true. Um, I've said that in videos before. Um, but look, I think for the most part, it seems like the 49ers liked him, you know, coming out of LSU, obviously, you know, hence to why they took him in the draft. Um, he rushed for 1,000 yards on 211 carries and six touchdowns this past season at LSU. Um, he's a good receiving back as well, so he definitely fits the Shanahan running back, you know, algorithm, I guess you could say. Um, so we'll see what happens. I like the pick. I just think it was a little bit surprising.